Hello and welcome to IB Times TV. Today is Tuesday, April 24th. I'm Lindsay Alexander and this is your afternoon gold and silver report. Gold prices rose today. They got pulled up by a rally in stocks and other commodities, particularly crude oil and industrial metals. But the volume was light, once again because active traders are waiting for a key meeting of U.S. central bank leaders to finish up tomorrow. Sometime Wednesday afternoon, the Federal Reserve is expected to issue a statement that will be closely analyzed for signs about whether the Fed will print more money or just let things sit. If the Fed sig signals that it's leaning towards another round of quantities easing, which is a euphemism for money printing, the price of gold will probably rise. But if the Fed tomorrow doesn't signal something like that, then the price of gold could stay under $1,750. The last two months have not been nice to the price of gold. Since February 28th, when gold closed at $1,791, the price has fallen more than 8%. At the same time, the gains in the first two months of this year were so strong that even with the recent drop in gold prices, the yellow metal is still up more than 6% for the year. Now let's look at how gold and silver did in the floor trading. Gold for June delivery rose $11.20 to $1,643.80, while spot gold climbed $7.10 to $1,642.58. Silver for May delivery increased $0.22 cents to $30.75, while spot silver was up $0.04 cents to $30.81. If you would like more information on precious metals, be sure to visit ibtimes.com gold. Thank you for watching. I'm Lindsay Alexander and this is IB Times TV.